These boys are awesome. Uh, singing a few songs. I, I don't know if you can call that a song. Um... Allez Paris, allez! <laughs> <laughs> I have been given the best job in football. I'm going to be traveling all over Europe following the Champions League. And in every single city I go to, I'm going to become a fan of the home team. Welcome along to the next installment of my Eurofan adventure. I'm at a train station right now in London. It's a very cold Tuesday morning. I'm ready to board the train and head to Paris, the city of love. And you know I love my football. Come on, PSG! arrived in Paris and as you can see behind me we have Parc de Prince which is PSG's home ground. I've got a football, uh, I've got some gloves because it's very cold. All I need now is a ticket for tonight's game. Come on then. Explain a little bit about Paris Saint-Germain. So far we've got here, it's quite intimidating. There's a lot of police about, uh, everyone's got a very Unhappy face. It's a Champions League match. C'est pas la même ambiance. C'est c'est quelque chose de voilà. C'est un public qui vient occasionnellement. Donc c'est un public qui vient une fois de temps en temps. Donc il y a pas. On peut pas recréer cette chose unique qui avait au parc et qui faisait toute sa magie. Coralie, it's been a pleasure to meet. Do we do we au revoir? Okay, au revoir. But I have one present for everyone I meet. So this because it's the city of love. You have a little chocolate. So enjoy. Au revoir. No trip to Paris would be complete without popping along to see the Eiffel Tower. Can't wait to get over there and maybe have a little kickabout with some people. Come on in. Monsieur? That's the problem. You come to the Eiffel Tower and everyone wants to see the Eiffel Tower. Oh, big deal. What about the football? Oh, yeah, that's what we're talking about. Messi? I love it. This woman's on his hand. Pardon? Oh, what is this? I bought two tickets for the game tonight. Paris Saint-Germain versus Dynamo Zagreb. Uh, I've never done this on a Euro fan before, but I kind of need to find someone to go with. Otherwise, I'm going to have two seats to myself. So I'm on the lookout for maybe someone I can take to the game with me. Are you Paris Saint-Germain fans? Sure. Sure? Um, if you are, are you Paris Saint-Germain fans? We have a, a chocolate for you. No, thank you. Will we win uh, the foot tonight? The, uh, tonight it is... Yeah, PSG versus Dynamo Zagreb. You didn't even know. Paris is a city of love. Yeah, so I thought I'd give you a chocolate. Chocolate. This is the, this is the good. You eat chocolate? Merci. Merci, au revoir. If if you if I had to happen to have a ticket, would you be interested in going tonight uh, to the game? Are you busy tonight? Yeah. Oh, you're busy. Just been wandering around Paris, and I'm yet to find any Paris Saint-Germain fans. I don't know where they're hiding. What I have found though, Hannibal Lecter there. Are you your Paris Saint-Germain fan? Yes. Okay, and uh, tonight I have my ticket. Are you going to the game tonight? Yes. Is it a good team to support? Ah oui, bah moi je supporte depuis l'âge de 12 ans. Awesome. Uh, singing a few songs. I, I don't know if you can call that a song. Um, allez Paris, allez! <laughs> but they seem up for the match tonight, so that's all good. So I'll just hang around with them for a little while. Where do you sit in the ground? You sit? I'm in Boulogne. Okay. Uh, yeah. and, and that used to be quite a, a fruity little area, right? It used to be quite. Yeah, we think, we think. Yeah, but it, maybe 10 years ago there was a lot of trouble in the. Yeah, Boulogne. yeah. I, was, I wasn't in uh, Boulogne uh, before. No. You buy a season ticket yeah. and the club choose for you where you are. 
Uh, this man, Johan, has helped me out so much. Uh, I can't thank you enough no for showing me, meeting these amazing people. Yeah. Uh, to, to show my gratitude, uh, my team uh, is Southampton FC. Um, and uh, on the back, I've got Copper 90. Uh, this is for you, my thank brother. Thank you very much. <laughs> We're waiting for the team bus to arrive so I can cheer on my newly beloved team, Paris Saint-Germain. They're up for it. This is exciting again. All of a sudden, it was quite quiet. They're singing rude songs about my. <laughs> Outside, trying to get into the ground. Welcome to Paris. This is more like it. Come up here, Stuart. Hopefully it's a better second half. I've just witnessed Paris Saint-Germain, PSG, beat Dynamo Zagreb 4-0. What a game. Uh, really, really good. Wasn't expecting there to be four goals. Some of the fans are still loving it. Great atmosphere. I saw none of that before the game and I was a little bit worried. I was like, where are the PSG fans? What's it going to be like? When I got inside there, uh, I was not disappointed. They didn't let me down. Uh, great, great fans. So I guess you're wondering, who did the Eurofan take to the game with him? Was it this Parisian lady? No, it was his producer. Now I move on to Spartak Moscow. That is the next stop on the Eurofan adventure. To get involved more though, you need to subscribe to Copper 90. Do it now.